tool pre-setting machine, but what about a tool pre-setting solution? Well, I'm here on Heimer with Andreas to find out more about it. So Andreas, what are we sitting in front of and how can it benefit a customer? Thanks Tom for being here. It's great to be back with MTD and uh, it's first time for me actually in the UK after COVID. So I'm excited to be on the market in the Birmingham and show our new tool management presetting solutions uh, to the world and to the UK manufacturing. As you rightfully so said, it's not a presetter, you know, but it's a tool management solution attached to a presetter. So we see here we have a dual screen. On one is the regular presetting software. On the other one is actually our tool management software. And guess what? This solution is already working in our own factory for many years and uh, we are working with it with 220 CNC machines in Germany producing six days, three shifts, 24-7 delivery. And I think it's great when you said that you're making these machines but you're using these machines to then make more machines. Absolutely and make more tools and tool holders so at Heimer we exclusively use our own product to make our own product and uh, that gives us a lot of competitive advantage when it comes to the easiness of use of the software, the easiness of use of our machines, because we know that our products are designed for machinists taking it in the, in the shop floor and taking it to the next level and producing parts with it. So what's the benefits for a customer of having one of these on their shop floor compared to just a standard presetter? Well, you know, uh, 10 years, 20 years ago, you have a standard presetter, you print out a label, you can still print out a label here, you put it on your tool, you stick it on your tool, and then you have, you enter it into the magazine, you have a fat finger problem, and whoosh, you are, you are ruining a spindle, you know, you're crashing a spindle, 25, 30,000 pounds damage, you know, downtime, a lot of other topics. Whereas this, this solution here is a full digital solution, including creating a digital twin. And I want to show this to you real quick how easy it is, because everybody speaks about making a digital twin. But, you know, we had the problem also one, two years ago in our CAD CAMS uh, programming. They took like 15, 20 minutes creating a digital twin, then starting the simulation. So that's longer than your assembler tool. But uh, with our software solution, it's so easy. It's like we just create a new tool, we create a new record here. So we say it's for an HSK 63. We look for a, a cutting tool out of our library. Like we have it here like a drill. So we take that drill and we have the data, everything in here. We have the shape data. And then we say, we want to not have this drill alone. We need on the left side, we need the tool holder. So we search uh, the uh, matching tool holder in order to create a digital twin. And guess what? Now we have created our digital twin. We have the shape file, the collision data, we can send that to CATCAM. So instead of using 15 minutes programming time of your CATCAM engineer, you can create with this tool management Vintool software that is attached to the Heimer presetter, you can create a digital twin in no less than a minute. And that gives you a huge safety and security. And now we are saying, transfer that data to our presetter. So we take that digital twin and see, is it really correct? We want to measure it, that we make no collision. You know, we want to make sure that what we have programmed, we have really assembled here correctly. So when I come here, I can say, okay, we are actually going to, we are going to the wind tool interface. We are opening up, we are opening up, we said, the record 220 was just created. So we have live created a record in order to measure it. And we are measuring it. So we get the measuring data back. So within one minute, we have created a digital twin. Within another 30 seconds, we've imported the data to the presetter, measured it, and now signed it back. And that's a huge advantage because then you can link it to a QR, to a unique ident number. You can send that data directly to the machine tool. There is no fat fingering problems anymore. You have absolute true and accurate numbers and that's a wonderful advantage for the customer. I love how there was the, uh, the phrase fat finger is just worldwide because we've all done it. I, I have to admit, I've done it before. You've gone to click a button, you've clicked to. So I love how that phrase has become a worldwide known phrase but also with the system that must give your customer process security and the trust that when they press that green button they're not going to break anything because if that shows your tool's not long enough you change it before it gets to the machine before it gets into the CAD CAM software you're saving so much time 
Absolutely. Uh, the main topic is really the productivity and the setup time gaining. So you're reducing your setup time instead of, you know, scratching the tool in the machine or measuring it in a laser in the machine every time you're interrupting the cut. But with this system, you know, you can actually rely on it. You can prepare hundreds of tools, send the data to the magazine of the machine tool, load it correctly. And with our unique ident number, you can be absolutely sure there's no collision, nothing. I want to show you another real cool cool feature um, when we come here back i want to show here a real cool feature coming to the unique end number fat fingering you can also use that system on your machine tool so we say we want to we want to have now here we want to search by qr codes so the machine actually we can link now the data to this unique ident number and the machine will also make additional measuring macros it will fully automatically measure it and uh, rotate and make the collision data and now to this unique ident number you have linked all the tool life the data and when you load the machine you can also scan it on your machine so you're transferring the tool life data into your magazine you have made sure that you have no collision and you're continuing seamlessly with your production without errors with higher productivity high utilization of your machine tool and something i've just thought of while you while you were saying that is also we know there's a skill gap. We know there's a shortage of engineers. Now you can put your trust in an apprentice or somebody who's been skilled up but not quite there yet, that as long as they scan the right QR code on here and the machine, the tool's gonna be right. That you cannot put the wrong tool in the wrong pocket. It's been done, I've seen it, I've done it. Not gonna say anything more on that. Yeah. But you, can, you know that your entire process is right because the QR code on this, on this system and your machine match up. Absolutely, the unique ident number is transferred correctly to your magazine pocket, like you said before. And that's why a lot of people ask me, oh, I have a 10 year old presetter, I still print out the label. But nowadays, as you said, it's a mean to fighting the skills gap because you not only have the, the skills gap, but you have a, a person who is new to the industry or a guy with 10 years experience will do exactly the same repeatable high precision job because he is guided. We have a fully automatic presetter. So instead of saving money on a presetting investment where you can use for 10 or 20 machines, you should invest in a fully automatic, automatic drive machine, three axis automated, digitizing it, making sure that you fight the skills gap because at the same time, you know, you can also look at tolerances. So you are not only fighting the skills gap, but this machine will always exactly according to the program macro measure every angle, measure every edge. And if you do it manually, you know, and you're forgetting one edge and that edge actually was broken, you have a collision later on or your process is not stable. So you make your process stable, you fight the skills gap, you can easily adapt new people to your shop, you know, and make sure that you have a very a wonderful productive production. And also give your process the st stability to run 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and you know nothing is gonna go wrong. Absolutely. So Andreas, I'd just like to say a big thank you to you. I know you've flown in for one day and I know we've took your time, but thank you for your time because your knowledge and uh, yeah, your knowledge on these machines and your ambition to keep making things easier and better for your customers is always great to hear about. So a big thank you from me and everyone at MTD. Tom, thank you so much. It's so a big pleasure to see you again and having these interviews on all the shows. I think we met on Emo last time, I think, that was in Germany. Now I'm here in beautiful UK. And, you know, I really feel that now we, all, we, we have the right solutions, you know, not only a product, but we have a solution and we can give a process to the customer, especially for UK manufacturing making UK manufacturing more competitive and more productive. And that's our target, helping our customers be more productive, earn more money, invest in the future of our beautiful industry and trade. So thank you so much, Tom. It was a pleasure having you here and all the best. Thank you. Thank you.